year $70 million deal with the Chicago Bears. So what does this mean for the Chicago Bears? Well, it does fill a, a need on the defense. And this pretty much means that Leonard Floyd is out. Okay, let's discuss that right now. Okay, the Bears have one of the most dominant pass rushers in the NFL, in Khalil Mack. We remember that trade, right? Well, the Bears didn't have somebody opposite that. Robert Quinn fills that. The guy that had 11 sacks in 2019 for the Dallas Cowboys. He was their second best pass rusher on the Dallas Cowboys. So you have to figure he's going to be up there again with that behind Khalil Mack. Him and Khalil Mack as your two edge rushers, that is that looks really, really good. Really scary for opposing offenses. And I think Khalil Mack might have suffered from that. You know, Khalil Mack only had eight sacks in 2019. For a guy that usually averages 10 plus a year. So having a dominant presence on the other side really helps him. Now let's discuss why Leonard Floyd. Leonard Floyd was drafted by up to get him from 11th to 9th. I think he was just too... I mean, he had the speed to be a good edge rusher but he didn't have the strength. His overall strength wasn't good. He would get beat constantly one-on-one. He couldn't handle blockers really well because of that. And overall, he was just never a dominant pass rusher in college. He only had like four sacks his, his senior year. So he was never a dominant pass rusher to begin with. So how do you expect a guy to be something that he isn't? And that's what's happened with guys like Kevin White, a guy that sure could have been a dominant receiver in the NFL, but was always injured. That probably goes back to his college days, too. Then you have Mitchell Trubisky, who was never a pocket passer, and you have to be able to make throws from the pocket regardless in the NFL. It doesn't matter how athletic you are or how talented you are. Those are throws you have to be able to make. But anyway, that's a different a different topic. The thing here is that Leonard Floyd just never panned out. So therefore, he's gone. Robert Quinn comes in and fills that void of giving them another edge rusher opposite Khalil Mack. And the Bears' defense looks even scarier than it is. So uh, be sure to comment below, and um, I'll uh, chat to you guys again soon.